a close win here in the opening round against NIP. Are you satisfied with your team's performance? I'm not really satisfied with what we did today. Honestly, we didn't play good at all, but the most important is that we win at the end. I mean, even though when we are not playing good, it's important to win. They, they were really good at NIP. They played some really good CS. They are shooting really good. And us, I don't know, we are really sloppy since we came here to Copenhagen after Stockholm. And uh, I think tomorrow we have this game at 7.30, so we'll be more awake than today at 1.30. And uh, yeah, that's it. Nico showed once again uh, dominant powers. How good is he? How good is he at the moment? Mark, he's in like for me, he's the best ever right now. Overall, I watched his him all whole his career, and uh, CS right now is is really something. There is a lot of good teams, and everything is different than it was four or five years ago. And he is just the best now. And uh, I, not, I have nothing to say. He's just amazing. And last, I don't know how my, how many ten months he's playing really really great, and I'm really happy for him because he's my brother and I brought him to this team. I, I tried everything to play with him and I'm really happy that he is as well happy and playing good. Are you satisfied with uh, the achievement you have uh, achieved here with Nico in, G in G2 so far? I mean, I, I cannot be happy because we didn't win a trophy, but we had a lot of second places, third places, fourth places overall. But I think we need one more step and I think next year will be ours and we'll win some trophies. And uh, I'm looking forward to, to, to just play, play next year's CS and uh, hopefully in front of the crowd as well. Do you think uh, you as a team rely too much on Nico popping off in the server? No, we don't. We don't look too much on him. He will do Nico things and we don't make plays for him, for example, or those kind of things. He's just Nico and he's doing things that he likes to do. And uh, we just want him to feel comfortable in the team. And that's that's what we are trying to do. And uh, all players on the team, they, we just want all, everyone to feel comfortable and to, to feel good in their zones, their sides and uh, on this side where they go. So this is the most important for me. And that's what we are trying to do with Nico. I want to talk a bit about Inferno uh, in the, the, the decider. Why did you st uh, struggle so much to close out the match? Again, I would say these second rounds for us, like we won 10 half, then we won pistol 11 five. It was, and uh, we lost the second round. Like I don't know how many times we lost, and especially on Inferno, this second round. And uh, it's like just for us pressure after winning this pistol round. I'm happy, and I'm not happy when we win the pistol round. So I don't know what to say. We we'll need to work on it, and we'll need to do something more, more simpler, I would say, and just be together. And uh, this was the main reason why they did this comeback. That that is something that pushed them to to, to do this comeback. And uh, yeah, that's it.